Hello, you are welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation? Solution from here. From what we have here, we take the right hand side to the left hand side, and we have x minus 2 all raised to power 6 minus 6 raised to power 6, then equals to 0 from here. Next step, we can write this as x minus 2 all raised to power 3. Then all raised to power 2 as 2 times 3 I give us 6 and minus also we have 6 raised to power 3 then all raised to power 2 then equals to 0 from here. Then here this follows the difference of two squares. When we have a square minus b square, the same thing as a plus b into brackets, then open brackets a minus b. That is here a standing as x minus 2 or raised to power 3 and b standing as 6 raised to power 3. And what we have here, follow this and becomes x minus 2 or raised to power 3 plus 6 raised to power 3 into brackets and also open brackets x minus 2 or raised to power 3 minus 6 raised to power 3 close bracket then equals to 0 from here that is here we have two possible cases the first one we have x minus 2 or raised to power 3 plus 6 raised to power 3 equals to 0 or the second one we have x minus 2 or raised to power 3 minus 6 raised to power 3 equals to zero here then solving on this side this follows when we have a raised to power 3 plus b raised to power 3 which is the same thing as a plus b into brackets then open bracket a square minus a b plus b square that is all we have here follow this and becomes x minus 2 plus 6 into brackets then open bracket x minus 2 all squared minus 6 times x minus 2 plus 6 squared close bracket now equals to 0 from here that is yeah 6 minus 2 that's 4 that's x plus 4 into brackets then open brackets the expansion here gives us x squared minus 4x plus 4 minus is open this bracket we have minus 6x then plus 12 plus 6 squared that's 36 close brackets then equals to 0 here which implies this becomes x plus 4 into brackets then open brackets x squared minus 4x minus 6x that's minus 10x then 36 plus 12, that's 48. 46 plus 4, that gives us plus 52. Close brackets, 9 equals to 0 from here. And also here we have two possible cases. The first one we have x plus 4 equals to 0. Or we have x squared minus 10x plus 52 equals to 0 here that is solving on this side we have x equals to minus 4 which is a real solution here and on this side we have a quadratic equation where a equals to 1 b equals to minus 10 and c equals to 52 and apply the quadratic formula which is x equals to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac all over 2a then what we have becomes x equals to minus minus 10 plus or minus square root of minus 10 squared then minus 4 times 1 times 52 all over 2 times 1 that is this becomes x equals to 
minus times minus is plus, and we have 10 plus or minus square root of minus 10 squared, that's 100, then minus 4 times 1 times 52, we have 2, all right, hit 10 all over 2 here, and this becomes x equals to 10 plus or minus square root of 100 minus 2, it does minus 1, all right, hit 10 all over 2. Which also can be written as x equals to 10 plus or minus square root of 36 times 3 times minus 1 all over 2. Then here, root 36, you can take it out as 6. And this becomes x equals to 10 plus or minus 6. We have root 3, then root minus 1, that's i over 2. Then here also, 2 is common here, and we have x equals to 2 into brackets, we have 5 plus or minus, 3 root 3 high left, then over 2 here. As this here, 2 cancel each other, and this becomes x equals to 5 plus or minus 3 root 3 high. As this here, we have two complex solutions here. Then, solving from the second case here too, this follows when we have a raised to power 3 minus b raised to power 3, which is equals to a minus b into bracket, the open bracket, a squared plus ab plus b squared. That is, all we have here follow this and becomes x minus 2 minus 6 into bracket, the open bracket, x minus 2 squared plus 6 times x minus 2 then plus 6 squared close bracket then equals to 0 from here at this here we have x minus 8 now into brackets then open bracket here the expansion gives us x squared minus 4x then plus 4 and 6 open this bracket we have plus 6x minus 12 then plus 6 squared as 36 close bracket equals to 0 here at this this becomes x minus 8 into bracket then open bracket here we have x squared then 6x minus 4x that gives us plus 2x then we have 36 minus 12 we have 24 then 24 plus 4, that gives us 28, close bracket, and equals to 0 here. And also we have two possible cases, that is x minus 8 equals to 0, or we have x squared plus 2x plus 28 equals to 0 here. And on this side, this becomes x equals to 8, which is also a real solution. And on this side, we have a quadratic equation where a equals to 1, b equals to 2, and c equals to 28. And also applying the quadratic formula, and this becomes x equals to minus 2 plus or minus square root of 2 squared minus 4 times 1 times 28 all over 2 times 1. That is, we have x equals to minus 2 plus or minus square root of 2 square plus 4, then minus 4 times 1 times 28, 1 around 12, then all over 2. That is, this becomes x equals to minus 2 plus or minus square root of 4 minus 1 around 2. 1, 1, 2, that's minus 1, 0, 8. Then all over 2. That is, that is, we can also rewrite this as x equals to minus 2 plus or minus square root of 36 times 3 times minus 1 all over 2. And root 36 there, you can take it as a 6. And this becomes x equals to minus 2 plus or minus 6 
and we have root 3 root minus 1 is i and over 2 this here 2 is common we factor it out and we have x equals to 2 into brackets minus 1 then plus or minus 3 root 3 high left then over 2 here which implies here 2 cancel each other and we have x equals to minus 1 plus or minus 3 root 3 high that is also we have two complex solutions and all together here we have six solutions in this problem two real solutions here two complex solutions here and two complex solutions here and thank you for watching don't forget your steps subscribe for more videos and turn the description bell on share this video give it a thumbs up and put your comments see you next time bye for now